Yeah. Okay, folks, field agent 390. I mean, excuse me. <laughs> Watch <laughs> out. Field agent 880 is video. 390 checks in the mail. Big block, four speed, 1960, what year? 67? 69. 69 Barracuda, 383 four speed big block car. Field agent 880 just purchased this car. A good friend of his tipped him off on it. I ain't going to tell you who that good friend of his is. We're going to get you. We're going to get you multiple angles here. This car here is the real deal. I think our research, uh, 137 were made with the four speed in the big block, I believe. And it was a black car. Somebody painted it blue. Get you on through the now the motors the motors out of the car but he has the motor and he has the transmission Saving 69 Plymouth Barracuda 383 four speed disc brakes manual steering eight and three quarter rear end black with white interior. Again, our research showed 137 of these were made with the 383 four speed. We haven't been able to break it down how many of those were black, how many of them came with power brakes power disc brakes we're thinking this may be a one of one again we don't know i know we, we did we're looking for the data plate we kissed somebody took it off we think it's in the shop we're going to try to find a build sheet inside the car so this is a real gem right here folks all right there it comes all right here we go 1969. Field agent 390. I mean, excuse me. <laughs> yeah. Watch out. Field agent 880. Field agent 880 just purchased this car. It's a friend of his picked them off on it. Thanks, Bob. <laughs> Thanks, Stephen. <laughs> See, if you wanted to know, if you wanted to know what the peril looked like of doing what we do, well, there it is. You can see that it was a white interior. Four speed. There it is. Coming out of the woods. Trying to get away from that cable just in case. But this is a eight three quarter rear end and disc brake car, power brakes. Yeah, it looked like it might have been an old hot rod at one time, maybe a race car, but uh, either way, that's uh, that was kind of, of these cars, with the 67, 69 Barracudas, big block four speed fastback, that's the car to have. Man, look at that, look at the grill and everything in that car. Like I said, it's got a hole cut in the hood, some hood pins, uh, it's been a hot rod at one time, the tack on the dash, golly. This is one of those cars that, uh, yeah, I've always dreamed about, looked at in uh, magazines and seen a couple at Carlisle, but never one in the wild and never one I thought I'd own. And this car is originally a black car with white interior. Gee whiz. Field Agent 880. I don't use awesome too often, Bob, but that is freaking awesome. That is you right there. Golly. 
Well, that's classic cars and parts, folks. You won't find this stuff anywhere else. I said that, you know, it, we we get out and beat the bushes on a daily basis. We're you always looking for something. On YouTube. First in our mind. Oh, yeah, we're, we're, we I'm, I'm, I'm uh, yeah, we're, we're legends. Look at this car. I mean, <laughs> the front bumper has still got the disc brakes on it. Yeah. Yeah. And a factory big block Formula S four speed. Got small bolt pattern rally wheels for this brick car. Gee whiz. I might have to. Uh, I might have to. I might have to forego that side of that Belvedere. Bob, this is a, this this is a more is desirable a, car. Than well, the Belvedere is not original, folks. No, it's a but, nice car, but it's not original. It gets back from paint. It might be up for sale soon <laughs> to help finance this one. But there it goes. Off to a new lease on life, thanks to Bob down at Bob's Classic Cars and Parts. You need to make him your friend if you fool with old cars at all. It's Field Agent 880. Thanks for watching. Bye. Okay, folks, we're looking at the uh, torque boxes. They look to be okay. We've got a flash, we've got a cell phone light on it. And uh, it's got an eight, three, it's eight and three quarter rear. Yep. Yep, sure is. Eight three quarter rear. Quarter and then up here at the front. The frame rail is also good on it. Frame on this side. Hold it, hold it right there. Hold it steady. A little spot there. I've got that one hole that's got a little weathered edge on it. Looking good there, guys, and go to the front. The fenders on it. Yeah, man. They haven't been cut at all. And the fenders haven't been cut for a set of headers. Front sway bar, disc brakes. Mm -hmm. This car is, uh, and when we, get, when we get the other side jacked up, guys, we'll look at it too. I think we got another. We pulled that charger. I don't know if you can see it. Pulled that charger out today, 66 charger. And we're pleased with how that one looks. Right, we'll be back with you a little bit, folks. All right, we got to we got to take the big block Barracuda off the uh, rollback to uh, go down in the woods and grab the other. There's 390, 880s in the Dodge truck. So we got to we loaded this thing last night. Now we got to unload it. Out of foot. all folks now we're gonna go down in the woods and grab another one all right is the transmission in neutral yeah uh, <laughs> we step on the park brake bob <laughs> uh, all right we're coming up on here What happened? Shackle hitting. I couldn't get it to take air. Yeah, I think the tank, the tank may be empty. 
I couldn't tell. I couldn't tell the gauge is bad. She's trying to come off. It's okay. You're all right. You're okay. Whatever you're doing, you're straightening it up. That's good. Block of wood. Yeah. Right. Why well, they got a shackle on one side and not the other? Well, yeah. well the yeah, car, cool. they went through a ditch, and the car was like this for a while. <laughs> <laughs> I think it'll uh, try pulling it up on there. Yeah, you're going to roll your jack now. You're going to mess your jack up. Here you go. Here's that block of wood. Hey, what are you doing with that other, that other lock socket? Right there. Okay. Is that enough wood? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Is that what you want? I have a wife down here. <laughs> 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 oh, there. He knows it's Yeah, right. <laughs> All right. He's letting the thing jack down. Let the jack yeah. down. Yeah. He's going to. Here we go. He's going to ride on the frame reel there for a little while. He's going out of frame reel. All right. Ready? Yeah. Look at there. Oh, cooking oh. with gas. All right. Make it up. The big block barracuda coming on the trailer, folks. And no motor in it, no transmission in it, so it's okay to load it backwards. Everybody will chill out. Hold on. Hey, you reckon that hood gonna hold the back of the trailer down? <laughs> Maybe. We're about to turn, just turn it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you need to, jack the car up again in the front. Stack them hoods in the back of the truck. There you go. Take off. You got it. There you go. Let's see if that'll get her. Drive. Somebody has either pre-raced this car or drag-raced this car yeah. back in the back. Oh, it's got a hook in. And a hole in. And uh, I got a shanker with this loose dropped over here. That's the way that thing is twist. Right, 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 right. It's right. in this corner. Right, right. Hey, we're just about on there, guy. All right. Put the chain in the back. All right, friends and neighbors, this is uh, your fun-loving field agent, 880, coming to you for Bob at Bob's Classic Cars and Parts. And this is uh, this has been kind of an ongoing adventure with this car and a few more, uh, but we have finally got it uh, safely home to our, you know, to uh, our headquarters, world headquarters, and uh, just want to do a quick walk around now that we got it, uh, you know, got it home and out of the, uh, out of the woods. And it is unreal the kind of condition this car is in. It's got some rot and, and, uh, rust, but man, this car's got a lot of good going for it. This is the 69 Formula S factory big block four speed Barracuda. Uh, look how straight the grill, the bumper and balance are on this car. And uh, it's about you know three below zero right now. So uh, just so y'all know, uh, I lost feeling in my fingers when I got my camera out. But uh, factory K member, aluminum steering box, power brakes, and it is disc brakes. I don't know if I can see it from here or not. But uh, you know this uh, this car was originally black. You can see there on the firewall. Uh, and on the fenders, inner fenders. Somebody painted it blue at some point in time. I was trying to get a look here. Yeah, you can see right there, this, this is a disc brake car. And uh, I wasn't able to get the doors open yet, but I was able to get the trunk open. And anybody that knows these cars knows there are certain parts that are specific to these cars because not many came with a big block. Most of them, your perform even your Formula S cars, the majority were 340s. Uh, was able to find the tail light that was missing. And uh, I don't know what that grill's out of. It looks like maybe a 67 Fury was in there. So I'm going to set it over here out of the way. 
because there were a couple of jewels in the trunk of this car that I could not believe were still in it. I'm trying to get this set up right where you can see it, but uh, there's the uh, the finish panel. I'll try to tell you a little bit right there. Formula S Barracuda, and uh, there was a couple of items in the trunk that just blew me away. That looks like the factory four barrel intake, that four hole intake for the 383. Is a factory four speed console, still got the ashtray in it, an extra thumb wheel radio. Now, I, yeah, it's hard for me to uh, contain my excitement when I saw that console in there because uh, I thought it was just a, a bucket seat car, no console. See the square lights are 69, but looking further. The exhaust manifolds for these cars are specific for an A-body. Uh, they have a, a particular bend that clears the steering rod on them, and they are hard to come by. Uh, and there's the factory exhaust manifolds laying in the back seat uh, and the rear bumper. So there's a, <laughs> there's a lot of cool parts, but something else I'd never seen before, you know, thinking about this car and how rare it is, being a you know factory black car, I thought it had white interior, but it doesn't. This car actually had saddle tan interior. I bet you that was a pretty car back when it was in black with the uh, tan interior. I don't know how rare that is, but, uh, yeah, I believe, I don't know, uh, they didn't make many of these cars to start with. So for one to be a factory black car with tan interior and a big block four speed, it don't get much, much sweeter than that. Uh, I'm going to uh, pause right here and uh, I'm going to go over and just take a quick uh, just a quick dip at the other ones uh, that we picked up and got home but there it is 1969 Formula S Barracuda factory 4 speed factory big block and uh, the original 4 speeds with it and supposedly the original motor is there and it's coming just got to go pick it up so it's a <laughs> yeah it just goes to show that some of these cars are still out there and you know that's that's a special car right there um i'm gonna get to get i'm gonna pause it here and get over to the other ones and uh i'll get, be right back